Hi, it's Ben Campbell again, and welcome to The Office. How to get the best out of your home office environment. Today we're gonna to talk about cameras and camera placement. I want you to think about one important point, that the camera is the eyes of the people that you are talking to at the other end. Let me show you what I mean. Most of you are likely to be using the inbuilt camera on your laptop. And when you place the laptop on the desk, this is the type of view that you get. It's not really that flattering, is it? Ideally, you want the camera placed at the same height as your eyes are when you're seated normally at your desk. It's also important to make sure that your camera is placed where your screen is, so that when you're looking at your screen at the people from the far end or at the document that's being displayed, you're also looking into the camera and in effect, the eyes of the people at the other end. But when you have a second screen, this can be problematic. Here we see a dual screen setup where the camera in the laptop is being used and the second screen is being used to watch the presentation. And this is the view that the people at the other end are going to see, not ideal. If we think about this in a real life scenario where you and I are sitting talking across the table, if I turn my head away to look at something else while I was talking to you, it would be a little bit disconcerting. We wouldn't do it in real life, so we shouldn't do it in a video conference. And this happens when you have the camera on one screen and you're looking at the other. You can easily solve this by buying an extra webcam and placing that on the screen that you're most likely to be looking at during the video conference. So finally, that takes us to the cameras themselves. Some laptops have great inbuilt cameras and some not so much. If you want to portray a professional look to your boss, to your partners and to your clients, it's worth thinking about a small investment in an external webcam like these. Not only will they give you higher quality, but they also give you the flexibility around placement. Some models even have fancy schmancy auto tracking in their cameras to make sure that you're always framed within the shot well. If you're using Pexip, they've started to roll out a great AI feature called Pexip Adaptive Composition, which does this natively for you. It automatically frames, pans and zooms the camera shot to maintain more natural eye contact and supports more realistic visual flows using relevant non-verbal cues. It's very cool. So there you have it, that's the wrap on cameras. Look out for our other tips on The Office, how to get the best out of your home office as part of our Leading in a Changed World series. Music